Alzheimer's risk factors found in young adults. We often think of Alzheimer's as a disease of old age, something that only begins to show up in our 60s or 70s. But what if the earliest signs of risk are detectable decades earlier, in your 30s or even your 20s? New research is changing the way we think about brain health across the lifespan. In a groundbreaking study, researchers examined data from over 11,000 people and discovered that well-known Alzheimer's risk factors, including cardiovascular health, immune function, and certain blood-based biomarkers, are already linked to cognitive performance in young adults, as early as age 24. That's right, Alzheimer's risk isn't just something we should be concerned about in midlife or beyond. It may be quietly influencing how our brains function far earlier than we ever thought. The team used the KED score, a tool that measures dementia risk based on blood pressure, BMI, physical activity, education, and other factors. They found that even small shifts in these indicators were tied to lower performance on cognitive tests like word recall and working memory. They also measured biomarkers of amyloid, tau, and neurodegeneration, along with immune and inflammation markers, and many were already associated with changes in cognitive ability before the age of 45. Interestingly, the APOE E4 gene, a well-known genetic risk factor for Alzheimer's, didn't show a strong link to cognitive performance at these younger ages. That suggests environmental and lifestyle factors may play a much bigger role in shaping early brain health than previously understood. The takeaway? Prevention can't wait. Intervening earlier, much earlier, with healthy lifestyle habits, cardiovascular care, and perhaps even biomarker monitoring, could be a key strategy in combating Alzheimer's decades before symptoms appear. This study is a wake-up call. It tells us that brain health is a lifelong journey, and it starts now. This video is based on the research paper, Risk Factors for Alzheimer's Disease and Cognitive Function Before Middle Age, in a U.S. representative population-based study, by Allison Aiello et al. in Lancet, Regional Health Americas. What do you think about these findings? Drop us a comment below. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more neuroscience news updates.